हेलो दोस्तों वेलकम टू सोरथम गेम्स आपका सोरथम गेम्स चैनल पे स्वागत है दोस्तों हम अनचार्टेड सीरीज की सेकंड गेम खेल रहे हैं अमंग थीव्स हमने देखा कि गेम की शुरुआत एक ऐसी जगह से होती है जहां पे ट्रेन रैक हो चुका है और वहां से किसी तरह से नेथन बाहर निकलने की कोशिश कर रहा है और शुरुआत में ही उस पर अटैक हो जाती है उस पर कुछ गोलियाँ लोग चलाते हैं और वो कहानी थोड़ी बैकग्राउंड में भी चल रही है जहाँ पर हमें ये पता चलता है कि बहुत कुछ समय पहले ही उसके उसे एक पुराना दोस्त फ्लेन मिला था जिसने उसे ऑफर किया था कि उन्हें एक खजाना ढूंढना है जो कि मार्को पोलो का खजाना है इसके लिए उन्हें तीसरा इंसान चाहिए जो कि क्लोई होती है आ, क्लोई यूँ तो दिखाती है कि वो नेतन को जानती नहीं है लेकिन बाद में पता चलता है कि क्लोई एक्चुअल में नेतन की गर्लफ्रेंड है अब यहाँ पे एक और बात है कि पिछले गेम में तो अलीना थी गर्लफ्रेंड लगता है उसे भगा दिया या उसने इसे भगा दिया है खैर जब खजाना ढूंढना है तो उसके लिए उन्हें एक लैंप चाहिए एक म्यूजियम से और वहाँ पे चोरी करने के लिए नेथन और फ्लिन जाते हैं लैंप तो मिल जाता है उसमें थोड़ा बहुत उन्हें पता भी लगता है कि कैसे खजाना ढूंढना है लेकिन यहाँ पे फ्लिन नेथन को धोखा दे देता है और वहाँ से सारी जानकारी और एक कागज़ ले भाग जाता है नेथन वहाँ से फंस जाता है और जेल पहुँच जाता है तो फिर कुछ देर बाद पता चलता है कि सलेवन और क्लोई वहाँ आके नेथन को छुड़ाते हैं और उन्हें ये पता चलता है चलता है कि उन्हें कैसे जाने खजाने तक दोस्तों अगर आपको मेरी गेम प्ले पसंद आता है मेरी कमेंट्री अच्छी लगती है तो प्लीज़ इस चैनल को सब्सक्राइब कीजिए आपकी बहुत हेल्प होगी इन वीडियोस को लाइक और शेयर शेयर जरूर कीजिएगा साथ ही अगर आप बेल आइकन दबाएंगे तो आपको आने वाली वीडियोस की नोटिफिकेशन भी मिलती रहेगी तो आइए दोस्तों अनचार्टेड सीरीज की सेकेंड गेम अमंग थीव्स कंटिन्यू करते हैं अगले पार्ट में charges all around the perimeter of the camp you two just need to arm them the first one should be right ahead of you here it is i also left the detonator for you uh huh All right. First one set. Don't touch the button. This one? Ah, cha cha. This one. Once you've set all the charges, just hit the detonator and it. Put the charge away. What? They'll never know what hit them. Just be careful. The Zarovich has got his men posted all around the perimeter. ये वही पक्षी है पिछली बार भी बुलेट प्रूफ था पिछली गेम में भी अभी भी बुलेट प्रूफ है यार क्या खा क्या है You brought a hooker to church? Why not? <laughs> hey, careful! Up ahead! Don't let him spot you. Let's take these guys out quietly. अरे quietly game में बोला मेरी बोलती के बंदों की. Oh, अच्छा. Quiet, mate. That's the other end of the line. Sorry, sir. कहा 
चार थी तो लंका नहीं है यहाँ पे अभी भी है कोई Looks like we can swing across there. <laughs> Maybe you can. All right, hold on, Grandpa. Let's see if I can find another way up. This way. Nate, you should be approaching excavation site one by now. Excavation site one. Acha, yani kis yeh? Should have been back by now. Ships have been spotted. Take them out fast. We can't let them slip back. सारे जानवर बुलेट प्रूफ है यहाँ पे मैंने तो कुछ नहीं बोला यार charges in there but you're going to have to clear the place out before you can arm them did you so so much again man Here's the camp. You ready for this? Let's do it. Milkul sir, I'm pulled to the gate. Don't let Lazarevich hear you talking like that.
तो लड़ गए जस्ट वट आई नीड ठीक है अभी एक हुआ है करेक्ट मिट 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 दो Okay, that's all of them. Now let's go pay Mr. Lazar a trip visit. Can't reach us. Come on over here. I'll give you a boost. Come on, gorgeous. Jump up. Yep. Great ass, Sully. Uh, thanks. Here you go, kid. Right. Ooh, that must have been some tsunami to wash these ships so far inland. ये वही bulletproof proof पक्षी बैठे हुए हैं यहाँ पे bulletproof तोते
it down. The pump is down again. Uh, the damn thing is always breaking down. Come on, let's just fix it so we can get out of here. Look, they're not armed. Well, not that many. What are we waiting for? We can take these guys. I don't know, Sully. Maybe... Drop down! There's someone here! Oh, everyone likes the jab! Could have used some help down here. Yeah, you were doing fine. Yeah. Oh, here's another one for you. Sorry. You can't put me. Yeah. Enough of this frivolity, kid. Come on, we got work to do. What does frivolity mean? What do you bet we follow the hose? We find the camp. You always follow the hose. Just like in Montreal, huh? You're never gonna forget that, are you? I think I see the camp up ahead. Three months and you have found nothing. Well, well, well now wait, wait a minute. We've been commander. That must be Lazarevich. This man was caught stealing artifacts from site number five. You would betray me for this? No, no, Zoran, I can't explain. No, no need, no need. I am surrounded by traitors and fools! What do you say we really ruin this guy's day? Do it. Go! Alright, it's all yours, kid. I'll cover you from here. Some fool left a sniper rifle up here. Careful, Nate. Looks like they left a couple of sentries behind. Okay, kid. It's showtime.
Have some of this. Man, this Lazarevich guy isn't screwing around, Sully. You should see all this stuff. He's got files on every expedition to find Shambhala. All the way back to the 1600s. What about Marco Polo's journals? <laughs> Here they are. Just hurry it up. You haven't got much time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The worthy pilgrim is granted a golden passport to conquer obstacles on his journey to Shambhala. Huh. Is that supposed to mean something? Beats me. Hold on. Here we go. It was with great sorrow that I left my fellow travelers to their fate. A fate decreed by the dreadful cargo we bore from Shambhala. They must have thought that tsunami was some kind of divine retribution. Wait a minute. Damn. Sully, I don't think the Chintamani Stone is here. What? Listen to this. I, I would have sooner endured the wrath of Kublai Khan himself than remove the Chintamani Stone from that sacred shrine. Marco Polo never had the stone. Then what dreadful cargo is he talking about? I don't know. Well, if the stone's not here, what the hell is Lazarovich looking for? Shambhala. Here in Borneo? He's a little wide of the mark, don't you think? He must be trying to pick up Marco Polo's trail. Back to Shambhala. Why? <laughs> because the stone is still there. <sighs> Chloe, can you talk? Hold on. Yeah, I'm here. In all this digging they've done, have they found any bodies, any remains at all? No, now that you mention it, nothing. Why? <laughs> Over 600 people were shipwrecked here, yet there's no bodies. Don't you find that a little odd? So where did they all go? Where would you go if a tsunami hit? To higher ground. Bingo. We head to that mountain. What do you bet we find Marco's pals? Chloe, can you meet up with us? Already on my way. Great. Uh-oh. Nate, you gotta get out of there. You're gonna have to give me a minute, Sully. You don't have a minute. What's this? They're all dead. Oh, crap. Right out. Stay down, kid. I got you covered. Ta -ta. Wait. Well, that's convenient.
in on me. I don't want him. Sully. Should be this way. Sully, look at these stones. Ah, now we're getting somewhere. Oh, catch a view, eh? Would you look at that? Oh, yeah. Hey. Hello. What do we have here? With any luck, the last resting place of Marco Polo's crew. Shall we check it out?
Wow, this place must be thousands of years old. At least. Down this way. Wow. Looks like we hit the jackpot. Ugh, there must be hundreds of bodies down here. Look at their teeth. They're all black. Let's think they're all that way. They must have taken refuge here during the tsunami. Hey, I think I found something. In here. What? They must have carried their cargo all the way up here after they were shipwrecked. More resin. I've seen this before. Sully, give me a light. This is blood. It's everywhere. Looks like a real massacre. All right, let's follow the blood stains. We'll see if they lead somewhere. Stand at this wall. Yeah, that's odd. This moves a little. Sully, help me out. Here we go again with the pushing. Yeah. I think I hurt myself. Sully, buy it now. Retirement, take it. The trail leads in here. Maybe I'm crazy, but it looks like they all killed each other. Come on, mate. I'm just getting spooked. Wow. Look at this. What do we have here? Nate, you're gonna give me a goddamn heart attack. Oh. Man, is that an ugly friggin' thing? What is it? Some kind of weapon? No, no, it's a, a purba. It's a ritual object from Tibet. It's used to destroy obstacles. Huh? No, you know, spiritual ones. Oh. Wait a minute. Hey, could this be what Marco Polo was talking about? Kid, I don't even know what the hell you're talking about. In his journal, he wrote that uh, the worthy seeker would be given a golden passport to conquer obstacles on the journey to Shambhala. So, what, this is it? Look, that's all really interesting, but where the hell is it a passport to? Well, maybe this map would help. Let me see that. <laughs> Between Greater India and the province of Tibet, lies a field of exquisitely finished temples. Hundreds of gilded spires stretching as far as the eye can see. Hold on, I know this place. It's in Nepal. Yeah. Except it's not just a field of temples anymore. It's a city. Well, that could make things a little more challenging. Kathmandu. Now, hold on. There's more. In all these many temples, only one conceals the secret path to Shambhala. 
And that path shall only be revealed to the pilgrim who bears the golden passport. Oh, <laughs> right. Nice work, kid. So what are we waiting for? <laughs> Let's get out of here. All right. See ya. Let's get going. Uh, दोस्तों मैं इस पार्ट को यहीं रोकता हूँ काफ़ी लंबा हो जाएगा नहीं तो uh, अगले पार्ट में मिलते हैं तब तक के लिए दोस्तों अपना ध्यान रखिए और प्लीज़ चैनल को सब्सक्राइब कीजिए इस वीडियो को लाइक और शेयर शेयर ज़रूर कीजिए और बेल नोटिफिकेशन या बेल आइकन दबाना मत भूलेगा तो मिलते हैं आपको अगली पार्ट में